Hey y'all, so today's video is going to be a little different. If any of y'all follow me on any of my social medias, y'all know I've been doing nails on myself since last year and been doing press on nails since like 2020. But I recently started taking clients this year, 2024, January 15th to be exact. And today I have two clients, so I want to take y'all along with me. My first client comes in like five minutes, but I want to show y'all around my nail room a little bit. So this is my little setup, so cute. It's not where it should be yet, but um, I just have my nail case that I just got, and then this is all the supplies I have on my table. This is for the client. And then, you know, it's a little too mighty mix in here. Still have my clothes in here. This used to be my office. If y'all followed me for a minute, y'all know that, so. Now it's my nail room and a creative space, so yes. My client gets here really soon, so I'll show y'all what I do for her. It's just gonna be a basic French, Valentine's French, and then I'm also doing acrylic toes on her or just gel polish, I'm not really sure yet, but um, yeah, that's what I'm doing today. Come along with me. Here's the fit, really cute, it's really cute. My grandma got me this top. And these are the nails, just did them yesterday. Yes. So, I switched my clients up. I sent them the wrong message this morning, both of them. I sent the one that was supposed to come at 9 a.m. the message for 5 p.m. and I sent the one that was supposed to come at 5 p.m. the message for 9 a.m. So hopefully, my client that's supposed to come at 9 p.m. like responds back to me. I asked her if she was on her way like two minutes ago. So hopefully she responds back to me because I really need that money. Y'all, I'm trying to get something from Amazon today and it costs like basically everything I'm making today. So yeah, um, hopefully. Um, if not, it's fine. I'll just cut down my Amazon, but whatever. Um, yeah, I'll update y'all, let y'all know what's happening. Bye. Okay, y'all, so unfortunately, she had to reschedule. Good thing she just didn't cancel. Um, but she had to reschedule because she has pink eye anyways. So she's just scheduling for next weekend. But guess what? My prices increase on Wednesday by $20. So she's paying me $55 instead of $35. And that's on period, okay? And I promise I have a shirt on. Y'all already saw it. But yeah, I'm just going to wait until 5 p.m. for my next client so y'all can see my next client. I guess it's only one client today. Not as exciting, but whatever. And um, yeah, I'm going to get Wendy's as well. So I guess I'll show y'all my day until my client comes here. So yeah. Okay, vlog. So my 5 p.m. client came earlier. So that is what I'm doing right now. I'm preparing. She's actually here right now washing her hands. She may say hi if she feels like it. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to do her nails. Let me show y'all the inspo pic. Do you want to say hi to my vlog? Yes. Okay. Like okay. <laughs> but yeah, this is what we're doing. And then I'm also doing her toes too. Do you want like nude or white or white? White. Okay. Yeah. I'll just so keep it right here. Oh, color. Okay, I'm saying hi now. Hi. Her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's about to slay my nails. I, I can't am. wait. <laughs> Do you want to fill? Because I don't have a soak off bowl. I could like redo the ones yeah. that are off or... Uh, I mean, I don't know which works for you. Yeah, some <laughs> of them are already looking yeah, crusty. Some of them are already, okay. I could try to improvise a soak off. We'll try to improvise. Because technically I need like a soak off bowl, but I can wash this and see if that works. Okay. Just finished with my client. This is her set. Yes, ma'am. Okay, y'all. So I have decided, since I have clients today, which is the next day, which is Monday, um, 2-12, I decided that 
I'm going to film today too because I have two clients today. One is coming right now. Um, she's 30 minutes out. It's 3.30. She comes at 4 and then my next client comes at 6. I am pushing myself to be faster, y'all, because I always take like three hours for some reason. Um, so I'm pushing myself to be a little faster. So that's why I schedule my clients at 4 and at 6. If anything, I could tell my client at 6 to come at 6.30 if I need like 30 more minutes. But yeah, I need to go faster. She's just getting her hands done. Um, an almond shape, Valentine's set, French hearts, glitter. Um, so yeah. And then my second client is getting, I think, almond shape too. Or like oval. Same difference. Oval almond. Like almond oval. Almond slash oval or round square. No, what am I saying? Almond slash oval or round. Um, that's what she's getting my second client. Just a nude set, just a nude overlay, and her toes as well, I think. I think she just went nude for her toes, too. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing today. Um, yeah, so this video will actually be three clients instead of just one, because I feel like that's, like, kind of, like, weird. Like, why am I filming a video of only one client? So, yeah. I will hit y'all back when my client gets here and hopefully she wants to say hi or something or at least say hi to the vlog or at least show her face or whatever so yeah bye how are you doing so y'all hey yeah my client is here this yes. is mrs karina hey <laughs> getting her nails done yes so is that what you wanted i think so okay. i think we could do that yeah it's not too difficult. Mm -hmm. Like, and it's really pretty. Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Per. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Okay. Oh, so, what did you do today? Um, I didn't do anything. I'm gonna be no. honest. I okay. slept okay, for the majority good. of the day. As you should, consider you don't have school today, right? No. Yeah, I don't. That's I good. go to school Tuesday to Friday. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know, but I do feel bad because no, like, you did squeeze me in. It's fine. Mm -hmm. I, I tried to do two hours. It's probably gonna be like two hours thirty. Mm -hmm. At least I'm getting my time down. That's all mm -hmm. that matters. Mm -hmm. And she even texts me back. I don't know if she's even coming. She's oh my god, that Friday though, uh, I felt so bad. It's fine. Mm -hmm. In the moment, were you like, how are you feeling? I didn't really care. I, I just came yeah. back from school, yeah. So I kind of mm -hmm. went to sleep. I think mm -hmm. that's what I did. I went to sleep. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, I felt terrible. So I think something happened. <laughs> so these are the nails, y'all. Yeah. Yes. Does that not look good? Yes. Mm -hmm. This is what they're looking like on Valentine's Day. Yep. All sparkly yep. and cheap. <laughs> okay, bye, y'all. Bye. Okay, y'all. Let's have a heart to heart. Ugh. <sighs> I feel like I'm doing so well. Well, first, let me talk about my clients. Um, my last client took me forever. Not even gonna lie, it took me like four hours, 30 minutes. She left at like eight, she came at like four. My second client that was supposed to come um, didn't come. She's gonna reschedule for another day, hopefully. And yeah, so I'm probably going to film my client tomorrow because I want to at least have like three or four people in here. I might do a week or I don't know. But I really need to get my retention down for my nails, y'all. People's nails are popping off, like they're breaking. And yeah, I feel like that's so bad because everything that I've done, like every client that I've done, they're not going to come back, you know? So, maybe, I don't know. But, yeah, I need to get my retention down. I looked up some videos, two videos, and they both had the same method. And they said that that method works really good. So, I wrote it down. And you're not supposed to use the sanding band on natural nails. But that's what they're doing. And that is what is helping with retention. So, that is what I'm going to do. Um, I feel like... You can't always listen to your nail instructor because they're telling me these things that I'm doing and they're not working for me. And it's kind of setting me back listening to them. 
So what I'm gonna do for prep nowadays, starting from here on, so that my nails can last and I can get returning clients, um, is I'm going to start off Okay, I'm going to start off cleaning or pushing the cuticles back, cleaning under the free edge, okay? And then after that, I'm going in with cuticle bits, this one right here, and then another one I just ordered, which is a carbide cuticle bit by Melody Susie. And then after that, I'm going to clip the cuticles that are still there. And after that, I'm going to dust, and like I said, no games. I am going in with a standing man on the natural nail because period, I, these people are saying it helps with retention and I, I'm struggling with retention and what they're teaching me in nail school is not working. Standing ban on a natural nail. Dust. Dust all that off. I'm saying dust way more than I should, but y'all get the point, okay? And I'm gonna put the tips on there, and then I'm going again with the sanding man on the natural nail, okay? Putting that, um, that, uh, like filing it or blending the tip to the natural nail. Dust. And then we're gonna go in with primer and then two bonders or bonder and then two primers because the tension is a bitch and I need to find a way to keep people's nails on because not everybody's nails like not all of their nails are falling off but like one or two you know what I mean so I just need or lifting or something so like I just need a new routine. I can't listen to what they're teaching me in nail school. I just can't. Because it's not working. You see what I mean? Like, nail school teaches you a lot. And people probably say this all the time. Nail school teaches you a lot. But they don't teach y'all everything. They're not going to teach y'all everything. Because it's just not the way it's set up. Um, so yeah, that's going to be my new prep routine. From here on out, I will tell y'all how it works. I have a client tomorrow. I'm probably going to film that tomorrow if they end up showing up. I mean, I don't know. And then I also ordered business cards. Let me show y'all just what I ordered. Hold on. So I ordered some things from Amazon both today and yesterday. Like I said, I was going to do. So I got this, um, like, disinfectant case because right now I'm just using like a plastic bowl and I need a case for it then the cuticle bits then some boxes to keep my disinfected and like um like clean and disinfected and to be cleaned and disinfected separated and then I got some toe separators because I definitely need those because I'm doing people's toes and those are popping off too so I'm going to do the same routine for those as well um yeah um, and I also got some business cards today because on Valentine's Day, I want to go to the Mall of Georgia and hand out, um, like with roses, my business cards so I can get my name out there and hopefully make up for the time that I lost because that's basically like, I mean, I started the 15th. That's basically like four weeks down the drain. Four weeks of clients down the fucking drain. All because I'm listening to these people in nail school. I should have just went on YouTube. Because that's literally what I did and I learned how to do it. So I'm going to teach y'all. Or I'm going to show you or I'm going to update y'all about how that works. Because I feel like it's going to work really well because like when I was looking at it, I was like, oh, they're getting everything off. Like... In nail school, they teach us how to get everything off, but, like, you still see things there. Like, you still see cuticles there and, like, stuff like that. They teach us how to get everything off the mannequin hand, which I hate because if you do that from the mannequin hand, it's gonna, like, it's not the real thing. So, yeah. Um, 
that is my routine that's my heart to heart and yeah let me show you all the business cards or i can show you all tomorrow when i pick them up or the day after when i pick them up so yeah but yeah on wednesday i'm getting a person coming back to me because three of her nails popped off and I already know it's my fault because of what people happen in nail school. So I'm going to apologize. I'm going to give her a discount for her next set. And I'm going to do the routine that YouTube taught me. YouTube University taught me. Because these nail school people know how to put nails on a mannequin hand. I'm talking about real people. Okay, I need to know how to take clients. That's what I need to know. Not clients in the salon at the school, but clients real clients for myself so that I can make some money. Okay? You understanding me? Okay. So I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Oh my god, I can also show I could also take y'all to nail school. Oh my god, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take y'all to nail school and then I'll be the end of the vlog. But I do have a client tomorrow, so y'all see that tomorrow too. Okay, bye. Okay, y'all, so I didn't do nothing at school today. Y'all already saw that, but I had a client today and I just finished with her. So this is her set, one second. Her, she just got a little cute Valentine's set, matching toes, yes, Miss Sierra. Hi, guys. <laughs> yes, period, period, period. I love it, I love it. Come to her, she's the best. Book with her, she'll get you right. Thank you. Of course, of course. The elbow is down, one end of the mannequin hand is down, make it wet looking like this, and get your full water on it. And now you look around the cuticle area really good and open the web. Make sure you check and turn the other side, everything's looking good. So now you're gonna go in and work. While you work, I'm gonna pack with you a lot of gloves, like five, six pair of gloves. You Okay, all so I just got back home not too long ago. Um, and I think this is gonna be the end of the vlog. I did show y'all a little bit of what I did at school today, but before I go, I want to show y'all what I got. I picked up some business cards. I ordered them like a couple days ago, a few days ago. This is the front, this is the back, and I'm just gonna hand them out. Um, since today is Valentine's Day, I wanted to hand them out either like it was gonna either be yesterday, today, or tomorrow. But I need to take my hair out. I need to do my nails over. Um, I need to have a cute outfit on. So when I do that, I'm going to go to the mall in Georgia and hand them out on Saturday or Sunday. And with some roses since Valentine's Day just passed. And yeah, I'm trying to build my clientele really quickly. Ebook coming soon on how I am getting clients as a beginner nail tech because I know that is like the hardest thing. So yeah, thank y'all for watching the video. I will catch y'all in my next one, bye.